So it's Hank here with a video on how to remove Advanced PC Care, which is a potentially unwanted program that doesn't help your computer at all. It's a program that will list when you scan your computer. It's going to list that you have a number of infections that don't exist. And uh, it's doing that right now. It's telling me we got malware. It's going to say that there's system performance issues. Uh, And um, in order to uh, in order to uh, use the full version is it wants you to purchase the full version and it, uh, this program really doesn't provide benefit to the user at all. It's just a way of making money off of you. There's better utilities out there. Okay, so I'm going to show you how you can get rid of this advanced PC care. Okay, because it's not really a virus or malware and uh, malware bytes anti malware is not. Uh, detected this as a threat yet so uh, therefore we're going to use a program called Ravel on installer all right you can download this by doing a Google search your immediate attention click on start repair to fix these issues yeah, it's a little automated voice in there. It gets annoying. Let's get so let's download a uh, Revo or Revo uninstaller, whatever it's called. It's a program that helps you uninstall a program completely. So download this program and install it to the computer. It's free. So when we open Revo uninstaller up, we want to do a complete advanced uninstall. So we're going to locate advanced PC care and we're going to double click on it. And it will create a backup of our computer real quick for us. And it will go ahead and will uh, uninstall this advanced PC care. Now, if you got this on the system, it's because you were running, you probably downloaded a program and you didn't uncheck all the boxes and it came on for there because it's normally bundled with the installation of software. And we'll just be going ahead and uninstalling the advanced PC care off the system. Uh, don't call these up, it's, it's just crap. They're just trying to get you to uh, buy any something. So once you uninstall it, it's going to say perform an initial analysis and uninstall. Check this advanced button, click scan. Alright, so it's going to list a whole bunch of different registry items that were left over. Click select all, then click delete. Once you do that, you can uh, click on yes. And there you go, it's now off the system. I recommend that you download and install something called Malware Bytes, anti malware on the computer, and uh, do a scan. I'm not going to do it in this video, it's not really needed. But Malware Bytes, anti malware is a free way of detecting malware on a computer. So I recommend you do a Google search for Malware Bytes. And, then I, and I highly recommend you do that if you got something like Advanced PC Care. And basically download that, install it, and run a scan that takes about 15 to 20 minutes to scan. And it will list any kind of infection that you may have there on your computer and remove it for free. The uh, full version gives you real-time protection, but you can basically remove any additional malware with the malware bytes, anti-malware. Alright, and also check out a program called Hitman Pro, another one you can download. I have a video already about that. You can download Hitman Pro for free as well, do a Google search, it's just another good scanner to have. And uh, even if you want, download Junkware Removal Tool, I'm going to leave the link in the description box. Open it up. Basically it will remove any other junk on your system that you don't want on there for free. It opens up in the command prompt, you just press any key to continue, I don't have time to really use that, but uh, I hopefully uh, once you download these softwares, scan your system, you should be good. And uh, remember to comment, write, and subscribe if you like this video.